Hello Sagittarius, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. This is a general message, so please take what resonates for you. You can look at your moon and rising signs for greater clarity. We have insecurity. Now this is, could be somebody making you insecure, somebody around you that's, you know, dragging you down, making you feel, you know, affecting your self-esteem here, or this could be you doubting your ability here. This little, little devil is a little voice in you that makes you think, feel you're not good enough or you've not got what it takes, which is obviously an illusion. Openings. Openings. A new door is opening for you. Yeah, you've just got to feel secure enough to walk through it. There's something new coming in here. Beautiful. Can you please show me the spiritual guidance in relation to this message, please? The spiritual guidance. Now, this is 22, so it's all the twos. There could be a message in that if you're into angel numbers here. Um, it's maybe worth looking that up. It's an extra message there for you. The Three of Cups. The Ace of Cups. There we go. Already on the table. New opportunity. The Justice card. Libra energy, well balanced energy, and the five of wands. Now, this can be self doubt as well. This can be you doubting your own abilities and your skills to bring growth, uh, internal confusion or conflict going on within you. Now, don't doubt yourself here. This could also be competition that makes you feel small. There could be competing people, there could be people that are, you know, antagonistic around you. Move away from this energy. We need to change this. We need to come away from competition. You know, anything that's making you feel as if you're not good enough here or you've not got what it takes, because that's just an illusion. Once you move away from this energy, this type of energy or the self-doubt, things change because fives are changed. The energies will change. New opportunities are coming in for happiness. Now, this could be new relationships. It could be new jobs. It could be new anything. It's the holy grail, the happiest you could ever be. So this opportunity here, this new door that's opening is to do with your happiness. You're going to be very happy about it. It's emotional. You're going to feel good. It's going to make you feel good about yourself. It's going to make you feel good about everything in your life and who you are. Always be proud of who you are and how far you've come. Reflect on all the challenges you've been through and understand what you've lived through and how strong you are. So don't feel insecure. Definitely not. And don't let anybody make you feel insecure. Now, this is karmic justice. If you're having to, you know, take up new opportunities for happiness, that there's be a fair and well balanced outcome for everybody. Now, this could be a legal situation, or it can be just you feeling safe because you've done the work and you're prepared to take go through this door. The universe is going to support you. So whatever you put into a situation, you'll get out of it. There's divine timing here as well, I feel so. I think you've waited a wee while for this opportunity. So don't, uh, you know, be, go for it. Go for it. Don't doubt your ability to take up these new opportunities. It's When opportunities come, it's because the universe feels you deserve it. You deserve it. It's karmic justice is at play here. Now, this could be dates. It could be celebrations. It could be invitations of any kind. It's time to celebrate. Have a good time. Go uh, be around the people that you enjoy. Have some fun, definitely. Be around all the right people. The Ten of Pentacles. The Two of Pentacles. The Page of Swords. Now, you're going to have to weigh things up here. This could be an idea that you have as well. This is mental energy. You're coming into the thought that, you know, you're starting to think, you know, maybe I could do this. Maybe I could take this opportunity up. Pages are the starts of enlightenment. That's what this is. You're starting to realise here, oh, this opportunity is for me. It's meant for me. I'm not going to ignore it. I'm thinking about it. But you're going to have to weigh things up. Now, it can be that you're juggling things here. You might have too much on your plate, so you might have to make room, uh, make some well-balanced decisions here in relation to your surroundings, your environments, your situation, so you can take up this new opportunity that's being presented. So head over heels decisions. Now, this new opportunity, this, it could be money, it could be jobs, it could be finances, it could be environments that we're talking about. But well-balanced decisions being made because you're starting to think, I could take this up. This is meant for me. And there's a lot of abundance and prosperity is going to lie ahead from taking up this opportunity. 
So you can put the work in here. You can work on things. There's going to be, you know, financial gains. There's prosperity, most definitely in that sense. Support networks around you, new people, new environments. This could be family supporting you here, financial support of any kind. There could be windfalls and inheritances that come forward at this moment in time as well. But the right people in the right um, situations are turning up here. And you will be, there's an abundance of support and prosperity in your life. So don't, don't uh, be frightened. I was just going to say, to take up this new venture. Don't be frightened to take up this new venture. Look at this with an open heart because this is going to be good for you. There's going to be a lot of growth that's going to come in from it. It's about sitting back, healing from the past, experiences you've been through. Like I said earlier, think about the challenges you've been through in life. You've got over them. You've healed. Self-care is needed at this time. Self-care is needed. So like I say, come away from antagonistic people or environments that don't serve you. And go away on your own and reflect on things and have a good think about this. Because this opportunity is being presented to you because you deserve it. And you're thinking about how you're going to go forward. So you could be brainstorming and how to weigh things up, like I said earlier, and making room for people, situations in your life. Or just pampering yourself now so that you can take time out, taking a step back to reflect and decide how you're going to go forward. Planning can be involved in this card. But definitely you could be recovering from illness. So take time out or challenges. Take the time out to do something you enjoy. And I did say earlier to have some fun. Because the good news is coming in. The good news is coming in. The messages are coming in. You're going to move forward very quickly. Emails, texts coming in. You could be going on that holiday as well. A holiday might serve you well here. If you're needing to heal from an illness, you might want to take a holiday before you start. It might help you heal from past challenges, make you feel better about yourself. But you're moving jobs, moving houses, moving country, whatever this is, you will be supported and the right, you know, the, the news is coming. The, the good news is coming in, most definitely. And there will be, you know, there's going to be fast movement forward here. Let's just see. Yeah, there's been upsets and disappointments that could have been heartfelt. They could have been to do with your romantic life. It doesn't have to be any heartfelt disappointments here. This is a temporary place. So there's something happened here that could make you feel insecure. Most definitely it could have knocked you sideways. But these clouds do clear and new opportunities will be coming in. We're moving on from these, from these heartaches now. We've done the brainstorming. We're ready to look at new doors. Uh, new opportunities and we're ready to work look, and walk through these doors onto brand new things and there will be fast movement forward very well balanced decisions taking you down a very well balanced path there's no reins on this chariot and here we are we're taking that leap of faith forward onto brand new journeys here starting from ground zero he's traveling light he's put his disappointments behind him he's taken time out to rest I'm saying he or she, it's not a gender specific reading. I'm talking about the energies on the cards. But he's taken time out to reflect on his situation, to heal from these disappointments and through brainstorming and listen to his intuition here, he's ready to go forward and new opportunities to take up new opportunities for happiness. And because you've cleared out all your insecurities and you've got over your disappointments, that's when the new opportunities are coming in. And like I say, this is karmic justice. You deserve this opportunity for happiness. Nature signs. Nature signs. Be receptive to the subtle messages from nature as you go about your day. Nature talks to us continually. We need only open our hearts and minds. So, you know, there's signs all around you here that the spirit is around you, that they're supporting you at this time. Connect in with nature. You could go for a walk. Something as simple as that. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye bye.